Pona do e bumdoche. E ti chou biyon. Paga dru ni na nama. Ki fwa mi fwa ma kanina yo. Ani meke nengwa kanina meke nengwa ye. Abu ni nengwa to zi achom keto sa lomo zi ya. Aga me meto akana otu ti fedi ichi ichi tata. Ni hinka ane ma seka. Chukwo ki kai biyama. Gozi yama zi nam de kanon. Ewa bono ono bo nyisi anye. Chakwa biyama nyi ari ke poliche. Ni hina ma zi nam de kanon. Ewa le gondi ya chua aja. Makwa dimma. Umu ibo. Ma dimma umu bia fanine. E yi kumbo faka wene kene. Onyi si a ye. The head of the retreat of state. Ma zi chike dozim. I want to thank him so much. And I'm very very proud of him. Just as I'm proud of Mazin Namdekano. I want to thank all the members of the retreat of state. I'm so proud of this leadership of this movement. I'm going to touch a whole lot of things today. Share this program. Because at the end of the day, you're going to learn something. On this platform, we teach and we learn in return. I am also very, very proud. Very, very, very proud of our legal team led by Barrister, Senior Advocate, Michael Zokome and Barrister Fanyi Chukwejofo. I'm so proud of them and I am thanking God for their lives. You may not like me and it's not a must that you must like me. It's not a must. At times, even father used to hate one of his child for any reason, best known to him. So you must not like me and you must not love me. But there is something you must love about me. The truth that I always speak on this platform. You can't do away with it. Because no matter how you paint it, Mazo Eleze will always tell you the truth and the right color. I'm very, very proud of the leadership of this movement. I've said it before, I'm saying it again. And I'm very, very proud of the men of Eastern Security Network Command. Very, very proud of them. And I want to appreciate them. My today's program is based on appreciation. But on that appreciation, there are a lot that I'm going to say that some of you may not like. You will not like it, but at the end of the day, you will like me. You are going to say thank you for saying the truth at all times. Yes. I want to appreciate the M branch of this movement. You guys are amazing. I don't know you guys. Nobody knew you guys. Therefore, you guys have done marvelously well. So far, so good. I'm very, very, I'm very, very proud of the principal officers of this movement. All the principal officers. I am proud of you. The coordinators, all of you across the globe, especially those in Biafra land. I'm so much proud of you. Super proud of you guys. Mechuku Karima, bless you. I'm also so proud of the financial supporters of this movement because that is the backbone of the struggle. Without finances, we are going nowhere. Therefore, I'm going to say a special prayer for each and every one of you that have been supporting this, this movement financially. Anywhere you are working, whatever you are doing to make money, which you are using to support this movement, my declaration on you today is that you shall not labor in vain. You will live to see this nation, Biafra, that you are fighting and supporting financially. No evil shall befall you. You shall not bury your children before your, before your face. You are going to enjoy the fruit of your labor. Everything you touch from this moment shall turn to gold. Wherever you are going, you shall go in peace. Whenever you are returning from wherever you have gone to, you must return in peace. No accident shall befall you. No poison that will have effect on your life. Because... Your support, your financial support on this struggle is the backbone that is driving this struggle to where we are now. I want each and every one of you to understand that I, Mazo Balezichuku, became do appreciate and love you people immensely. I love you people because without your financial support, we cannot do anything. 
Therefore, I appreciate each and every one of you that are supporting this movement. And I pray that your pocket will never go dry. As long as you are supporting this struggle, your pocket will never go dry. Never, ever, ever, ever. Unubuona ke bunu gebuti forma. Unubuona ke bunu gebuti ni forma. Unubuoni runu gebuti forma. Unubuona zunu gebuti forma. If forma, if forma gabo kono. Arunu ni ne gabo yego. As those that hate the Igbo says that Igbo love money. Money go to those that loves you. You must locate every Igbo man, every Igbo woman, every Biafran that is struggling anywhere and anyhow to support. Whether you are supporting through the media, whether you are supporting through the coordinator, whether you are supporting anyhow, as long as you are bringing out that money for the sake of this movement. I say, Meokike, bless you. If there is any woman that is married supporting this movement and you are still not yet, you haven't given birth, I pray and decree that you shall give birth to bouncing baby boys and girls. There shall not be barren in Biafra land. Any man that is asking God for a favor for marriage, shall receive it, as long as you are supporting this movement. Because we are fighting for a nation that is going to give a better sense of reasoning and good life for our offsprings. Therefore, there shall be no barren in Biafra land. Any woman at all. And those of you that are pregnant and you are supporting this movement, your husband is supporting, your brother is supporting, your sister is supporting, you will give birth successfully. We shall hear the cry of the baby and see the laughter of the mother. I am still praying for those financial supporters of this movement. Chuku Kabema shall continue to bless each and every one of you because without finances, we are going nowhere. Therefore, I thank you so much. I thank you immensely. However, you have supported this movement financially. May Okike bless each and every one of you. To the broadcasters, those on Radio Biafra, May Chuku Okabema bless each and every one of you as well. The media warriors, may Okike continue to bless all of you. All the media warriors of this movement, you are in, you are the men and women in front line. Chineke Gagoziro Munu Nine, those of Liche, before me, for my Kono Gane Mwata, Ajong Mama Fon, Ajong Mada Mama Fon, Ajong Koge Mwona, Ajong Mwada Chepo Nakuya, Ajong Mwona Mama Hangwere, Ajong Mwata Mwona, Ajong Mwona Njoha Wana Nazare Mwere, Ofan na goni sunu buka chine ke nyune yezu bwa mamife pliche. Ngota pliche. Ogunu ge face camera ne ukuwa. Ogunu gana radio ne ukuwa. Kikifu ne ukuwa burifege nye chine kuto. Yifege ye meka biafra mwere o mwere. This is my declaration. And so it shall be. I am very very proud. Of biafrans. IPOB. And those of. You that are supporting the movement. Friends of biafrans and lovers of freedom. I close the club. Bless each and every one of you. Now, let me go straight to the point. The reason why I'm doing this video. I have noticed that Mwada Chalugo is here. Mwada Chalugo, welcome to the program. Ome Penny, you are here. So many of you, Pascal, Madubugu, Odogunwa, Nobili Suzo, you are here. Oka for Chinedu, God will bless you for me. You are a good man. I have been seeing your comments in all comment section of every media warriors with audience platforms god will bless you this is a 21st century and on this 21st century what is made available to us we must make use of it properly and that is social media if you watch closely now you understand that media every information that you needed now both the good the bad and the ugly is on social media nobody listens to bbc and the uh, CNN Bruha anymore. Everybody is on social media. Mark Zuckerberg, thank you so much for giving us this platform. Even though you are fighting us, we still appreciate that you give us the platform to air our opinion, to pick up things that is happening in our land and bring it to the notice of the world. Therefore, we do appreciate you too. Thank you very much for giving us your platform to fight, to use and fight for our freedom. Thank you. 
Straight to the movement. Straight to the point. I mentioned every facet of this movement, every branch of this movement, and say that I am proud of them, I appreciate them. But there is something I'm going to say that will shock some of you, and some of you will be angry. And I have to say it the way it is. While I am appreciating those of you that are doing good, while I am appreciating those of you that are following the organogram of this movement under the leadership of Mazen Namdekano, in his absence, the DOS, led by Chike Doziem, I must remind you, there are those of you that have fallen back. <coughs> Excuse me. There are those of you that are falling back. There are those of you that are no longer active because you no longer see Mazen Namdekano. I have a word for each and every one of you. I don't like eye service. The people that I am thanking are those that stood with Mazen Namdekano when Mazen Namdekano was outside and still standing with Mazen Namdekano that Mazen Namdekano is in the, in the hand of the enemy. Those are the people I'm appreciating and thanking. I'm not thanking anybody who is who was there talking, supporting the movement because you are seeing Mazen Namdekano, you are going to get noticed by him. I am not thanking you. Because when Mazen Nan can talk about 100 men, he's not talking about just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 to 100 men. He's talking about 100 men in one man, you count them one. 100 men in one man, you count them two. And these are leaders of 100 battalions. In case you don't know. So, to all of you that have stood with Mazen from the beginning, especially those that started with him, Especially those that stood with Mazen Nanakano when people were chastising him, when people were castigating him, when people were fighting against him, when people were calling him all manner of names. There are few in this struggle that stood with Mazen at that point in time. Very, very few that stood with Mazen at that period of time that nobody, not nobody, few people, only but let's say 3% of Biafrans appreciated him. 3% as a then. We are over 70 million. But I'm telling you that when Mazen Namdekano started, it is only but 3% that supported Mazen Namdekano. If you do calculation of over 70 million, then you do the 3%, you see that it was very few. But now I can tell you that 95% of Biafrans are following Mazen Namdekano today. In case you don't know, 95% of Biafrans and those who are saying we are Igbos, we don't want Biafra. Mazen Namdekano was fighting for everybody and is still fighting for everybody. When he was asked, what is your problem? What can we do for you to stop this movement? He told them, I want a good job. I want a good road. I want a viable development for my people. He was not saying for IPOB members. He was saying for my people. And the people he was referring as his people are all Biafrans, from A to Z. In the past, I have told you people that there are those who we are called and there are those who we are choosing. Yes, and there are those that call themselves. In this movement, I have, I took my time. If you watch, you see that for like one week plus now, I have not made any program. I'm going to two weeks or even more. I have not made any program. Why I wasn't able to come online to speak to you, I was doing a whole lot of research. And I was doing a whole lot of checks and balance. I came to realize that a lot of our people have fallen by the roadside. I came to realize that a lot of our people are weak. I came to understand that a lot of people who are shouting, Mazen Nam the Kanu, Mazen Nam the Kanu, we love him, we love him, we support him, we are moving with him, we will die with him, have fed up. I don't want to mention names, but I know them. Those that are very close to Mazen Nam the Kanu, I know about 50 of them. 5 0. 
that visit Mazinda and Kanda, visit Afaruku 247. Those I have seen with my two opticals. I'm not telling you about people on Facebook. I'm telling you about people I know. They have fallen by the roadside. Makano de Hakudo Jago. They are all waiting. That Mazinda and Kanda, once he came out, you see all of them jump outside. Oga Hakuna got for the beast in me. You people have never seen the beast in me. Because when IPOB was proscribed, that was the first test of time in this struggle. A lot of people ran away. You want to go to heaven, but you don't want to die. All the chicken hearted followers of Mazen Nam, the kind of in the struggle, they disappeared. Simply because IPOB was was called terrorist organization, which is the normal language of the oppress or oppressive states. They always call anybody who is trying to liberate himself from the oppressive state a terrorist. They are the one terrorizing you. They are the one holding you down. They are the one taking your mineral resources. They are the one enjoying the future of your future and that of your children. And they are calling you terrorists. And so many of you disappeared. When we remember for People like Mazo Belize Chukuku became was on the ground and he stayed there. If you like, call us any name you want on this planet Earth. It will not shake me. Because I knew that people who fought for their freedom, if they are not called terrorists, that means they are doing nothing. They have not started. It happened to Mahatma Gandhi. It happened to Mandela. It happened to so many of them that fought for their freedom. So you cannot... Come now and hide. And you are peeping from the window. Tomorrow, Mazen Nandikano will come out. You jump out to say, Hey, Mazi, hey, hey. Oh, Mazi, we are following you. We thank you. We are with you. Anybody who tells you I am confused in this struggle was not meant to be in this struggle in the first place. You don't need to be confused. Your father built a house, set it up, beautify the house. Told you that if I leave this house, your mother is the one that is in charge as my wife. Anything your mother tell you to do in my absence, do it. It doesn't matter whatever it is. If I travel and you didn't see me, look upon your mother. Your mother is the only one that is supposed to tell you what to do and what not to do. Because I built this house together with your mother. I remember the story my own mom told me. How she built the first house with my father. With Ajopa. With Ajopa. Ajopa. That was the first house that my father built. You all know that Ajopa. That mud house. I will say, it was just me to tell you, you wouldn't know. That was the first house that my father built. At very young age, because my father married very young. My mother now Zaja, although he my father, my father they were near the block. My mother Zozo Zobunia, both of them were in low eight rooms and parlor. They suffered together, they built the house together, and they were planning for a future for me and my siblings. They knew we need to stay in a house. They knew we are not supposed to be gallivanting or begging to stay in somebody's house. They knew that we need a shelter over our head. That is why as soon as my father married my mother, he left his father's house and he went to his Anobi to build his own house with my own mother. My mother is the larger on us on eight rooms and palo as a den. I just want to use my parents to give you an example about what I'm talking about here because I'm going to touch a lot of people. And if you know anywhere it touches you, you amend your way. If you don't like to amend your way, that is left for you. I don't care. So if my father suffered to build that house with my mother, though the house had been destroyed a long time ago, those of you that knows me know what I'm talking about. And a better building was erected by my same father. 
until I came up to build my own. There is no how my father will go on a journey and leave that house he built with my mother and tell, my, and tell we, that we that are their children to obey and follow and listen to my mother. Then a neighbor, a far distance neighbor, who doesn't even have a house, who have not built a house. I'm talking about those that says, I am confused in this struggle. I am speaking to each and every one of you right now. I'm talking to you guys. A distant neighbor, somebody who have not built a house, who is still living in his own father's house, will now come to my own father's house, the house that my father built and left my mother to be in charge, and begin to give me order, give my brother's order, give my sister's order, begin to fight against my, me and my siblings. When my mother tells us what to do, a neighbor who have not built his own house will come and say no. That what my father, what my mother is saying is wrong. That him that have never built his own house is the one to, to tell me what to do. Thank you very much, Mazi Benjamin Madubugo. Dogumbuna Pefra Land. Anonkankanko. Ikrikeja Gonodo. Asisemu nangwebino. Nawa sako hoja aliugu. I salute you. Welcome to the program. Those of you that say they are confused, I'm talking to you. Because you know our people sometimes when you don't give them, when you don't use OCC, they can mad. OCC, they can mad. We are malo fat. At this juncture, you are still confused. Then you are a fool. At this juncture, you are still, you know, going against the rule that your father lays, lays down to your mother before he left the house on a journey. Following someone who is not a family member, who did not build the house with your mother, listening to someone who is not even close to the family that your father left for you, your name is sorry. Have a given do. Never, ever, ever in your life will you learn. You will never grow again. Because when the foundation of that house was laid, it was laid between you, your father, and your mother. And I use my own parents to give you example. Those days there was no bro no block. Onaja was what we used to build. Not there was block, but it wasn't as easy as it is now. Umuro community, there's no community in Biafra land you go without seeing a mud house from at least past 30 years down. And your mother suffered with your father to build this house. And the house is set for your own benefit, for your own good, for the, for your, for the betterment of, your, of yourself and that of your children that you're going to give birth after your father and your mother that led the foundation is gone. Then someone from another community, someone from another village, who is not even in the same village with you, come to your house, try to scatter that house which your father and your mother suffered to build before he traveled. I want you to think. Those of you that are still confused, those of you that are still, uh, that are no longer supporting this movement because they think they are confused. I want you to think. I want you to reason. The reason why I'm using the narrative of father and mother and children for you is because that is the closest and the easiest example that people like you need at this point in time. Because why I was appreciating all the people that are doing good in this struggle, the leadership, the media department, the legal department, the IPOB finance supporters, the security side of it, and all that. I am not referring to people that are still claiming to be confused in this struggle. I am not. You have to share this program because I am speaking to somebody today. Like I said, I'm going to offend some people. I might 
likely not going to mention people's name, but I am going to step on toes of a lot of people in this program. It's not yet time to answer call, please. It's not yet time to answer call, please. It's not yet time to answer call, please. Whoever that is calling now should wait. When it's time, I will open my line, you will call. Please don't call now. It's not yet time. Oh, bro, this is not the time to. This is not time. This is not time. This is not time to call. I have to put off this uh, phone so that there will be no call disturbing us. So now I want you to understand something. I'm using your father, using your mother, using you, your brothers and your sisters as an example to what is happening and why I'm very proud of this leadership. Mazen Nandukan is the mother. Uh, sorry, Mazen Nandukan is the father. The Rectorate of States are the mother. Together they built the foundation of this movement. And as I'm talking to you right now, the IPOB family worldwide are the children. The foundation was laid for the betterment of each and every one of us that are following Mazen Nam the Kano. The foundation was made for our children and our children's children. Now our father have embarked on a journey. The same journey that will give us a better tomorrow. Even though we know that the journey is very is a very difficult one. Then some members of my own family, of your own family, begin to listen to somebody who is not a member of the family, who was not there when the foundation of that house was built, who was not there when Mazi set up all the plans. And you begin to listen to that person who is an enemy to your family. If this person is a member of this family, I will not have any problem. Because a member of family have a say, but not as the leader. But this person is totally not a member of the family. This person does not know anything about the family. This person does not know the foundation, how the foundation of the family was laid. This person came to destroy the same house that your father built with your mother. And you, as a family member, left to follow your mother, left to listen to your left, uh, left listening to your mother, and following that person who is not your family member. Are you worthy to be alive? I'm asking you. You are not worthy to be alive. It's better that you drink poison and die because you do not know the sufferings that your mother has suffered with your father to set up that, to build that house and that family. And I want to tell you, no sane man will destroy a house that is the joint hand to build. That is why people like me, when I see anybody who want to destroy this house that suffer, that I am part of am part of those part and parcel of those that build it. If I say it is not bragging, why so many of you we are still sleeping, doing your businesses, going all, all your normal business? I was there, making sure. There are people who to Roma. Simba, then I roll Lachanuma, or when they were Ube, then I roll Lunga, Lachanube. We all built it. So I cannot be a party to destroy a family that I built, that I supported to build. That is why when I look from the inward and see anyone who is coming close to destroy that house that my father had built with my mother, with my little support, no matter how small it is. I don't take it easy with you. So, all of you that have backslided in this movement, all of you that have run away because you are no longer seeing Mars, because you, you are no longer hearing from Mars, knowing fully well that where Mars is, is a journey 
that when he comes back from, you will be happy again. I want each and every one of you to wake up. When Mazi was outside, the sharing button of Mazi broadcast is in tons of hundreds of thousands. But as I talk to you right now, so many of you cannot even share when Mazi Chinas or Mazi Chikedosium is broadcasting. You can't even touch the share button. And I want to correct an impression here. I, I promise you I will step on people's toes today with truth. And you will not like it. But later you have to like it. I want us to condemn and kill that narrative that says listen, that narrative that says that when Mazen Nandi can come out, he will fix the struggle. That is a very wrong impression. And sometimes, out of anger, out of emotion, I do use such words. But not always. Maybe once in a while. We, should, we are not going to leave any stone unturned. We are not going to leave anything for Mazen Nandikam to come out and fix. This directorate of state led by Mazichi Kedosium, whatever they say becomes a law. The IPOB Mazenan can left in their hand is going to be better when Mazenan can come out and they will hand it over to Mazenan can. Knowing fully well that have fought even the enemies from within and outside. So I'm talking to all of you, those of you that are writing, those of you that are speaking on radio, those of you that are even speaking on your platforms as media warriors. Don't use that word again. You see that phrase? You see that phrase, when Mazenan can come out, he will fix it. Is giving that phrase is giving the enemies hope that they are doing something well by holding Mazenan the cannon. So that thing that you are doing, that you are expecting Mazi to come out and fix, they will continue holding Mazi, making it impossible for that thing to be fixed, believing that without Mazi coming out, that such things will not be fixed. When we have an organized leadership that are out here fighting and doing everything humanly possible to fix everything that is needed. Do you understand what I'm saying? I want to repeat what I said again, because like I said, I'm going to step on people's toes, saying the truth on it. Stop saying when Mazen Nandi cannot come out, he will do this, he will do this, he will do that. Stop saying that. The more the enemies listen to each and every one, in case you don't know, they listen to each and every one of you. All of them, they liked our pages from A to Z. They are following us with fake accounts. When I when I speak, I say, when Martin Nandi can come out, he will fix it. Methuselah will speak and say, when Martin Nandi can come out, he fix it. Achalu will come out and say, when Martin Nandi can come out, he fix it. The African child come out and say, when Martin Nandi can come out, he fix it. The enemy will say, oh, that means there is something that's spoiled. Oh, if I may bring... Ah, okay, for that reason, we are not going to free him. Because we don't want him to come and fix those things. Use your number six. According to you, please, if what I'm saying is in line, I want to see your comment on the section. I don't know whether people are reasoning with me. They are listening to us. And that is why I said anybody who is blaming, who is apportioning blame to Mazen Namikam or the leadership to cease from doing that, sometimes out of anger, out of passion, out of emotion, I may slip, it may slippily go out of my mouth that Mazi did this on, but it is over. From this moment ongoing, we should never ever say Mazi should come out and fix. DOS is fixing every shit that is happening in this struggle. And we must stand with them. I have called on the DOS doing open program, speaking to them because all of them watch my program, telling them, as long as I'm concerned, the office of Mazichi Kedosium is very, very, very powerful. 
His job is to take the right decision and announce it. Our job is to back that his decision, not waiting until we hear from Mazi. The position of Mazi as the supreme leader is there. Somebody whom you are holding on the ground is still on the ground telling you, if I get up, I'm going to cut off your head. Are you going to leave that person? You are fighting with somebody. You have destroyed this person one eye and he's on the ground telling you if I get up, will you allow that person to get up? You will never allow that person to go. You stay the boy there. Come on, you get beneath their bogey. That is something we look at the nature. I told DOS to continue to do whatever that is need that is needed to, to be done should be done. It doesn't matter who you are. The way I fight my battle may be different from the way other people fight their battle. Me, I look at the battle one on one in the face. I, I attack it. Some people they look at the battle, they go behind and they'll be fighting it from behind and they'll be touching their face. No. That is not how to fight in a freedom fighting. Bring out your face. You fight dirty sometimes when even your own co your fellow comrade is going the wrong way. You have to come outside. Look into his eyes. Let him know that what you are doing is wrong. It is not that you are fighting him that you hate him. You are fighting to stop him from doing that which is wrong. Because if you don't do that, there will be a problem. Why the states that are holding us down is pushing out money into the pocket of those that are distracting us, into the pocket of those that are trying to destroy what we are doing or make what we are doing look like we are child, we are children. And we are saying, if Mazen Nandi can't come out, he will do this, he will do that. No! Definitely Mazen is going to come out. There is no two, about, no two way about it. Mazen will come out very soon. But before Mazin and come, cannot come out, we are not going to keep any, we are not going to keep any 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 heap of problems for him to inherit. You deal with it. That is why I remember when I started with Nen Nihanya, I didn't wait for Mazin and Khan to come out and, co and correct any wrongdoing of Nen Nihanya. And that was the only crime I saw I committed. Because at times I go back to study other freedom fighters, how they fought, what they did. And in freedom fighting, there is no special friend and there is no special enemy. You may be my friend today, tomorrow you become my enemy. You may be my enemy today, tomorrow you become my best friend. As long as you are going out of the lane, Monaco will fall apart. But once you are in the lane, we become one again. So don't use that phrase. When Mazi come out, he will fix this. When Mazi come out, he will fix that. When Mazi come out, he will fix What are you doing? If we are all waiting for Mazi to come out and fix things, then we are going nowhere. What is the leadership doing? The leadership is the people that Mazi have given the authority, the power of attorney, to act on his behalf. So if there's anything going wrong, they should stand up and take the action. We in the media and every Bia fans across the globe will stand up and say that is what we say. That is where we stand. Even if the directorate of states of this great movement is led by a five years old boy, I'm giving you an example. By the virtue of that particular post as head of the directorate of state, that five years old boy will no longer be seen as a five years old boy. His age will become irrelevant. The authority, the power that is constituted on the seat which he is sitting upon will be greater than each and every one of us. And what, his, what he says goes. Chikedosim is being insulted on daily basis by the enemies of this movement. Because 
we allow it to happen. Chikedosim is allowed to be insulted. Chikedosim is allowed to be called different kind of names by some idiots in Finland and those in Germany. Because we, 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 the Biafans that are following Mazen Amikano, allow it to happen. I am going to offend so many of you today. But it's going to watch it because when you go back and watch this program again, you will come to realize that this man is telling, the, is telling you the truth and nothing but the truth. As I speak to you right now, there is no Northerner that can stand up and speak against Boko Haram and their leadership. Knowing fully whether Boko Haram and their leadership are terrorists. No governor has the nerves to condemn the activities of Boko Haram. No governor, no politician in the north can come out to condemn the activities of Mieti Allah. Mieti Allah will come out in the open and claim responsibility of what Fulani Hesmen have done and threaten the government, give them order, say you must pay us a certain amount of money and they will, the money will be paid to them. You can't see them condemn their leader. Why Abba Kashikau was there, nobody condemned Abba Kashikau. Be you a governor. You don't, you, who born you? And these are terrorists. They are only fighting on a cause they believe in, in a violent way. We are fighting on a cause we believe in, in a peaceful way. Then our leader is being apprehended, kidnapped. Then the person that our leader appointed to assume the position of the leadership supposed to be seen the same way we see our leader. We have gotten to the stage whereby only open up by the Facebook on in any country. IPOB in that country Ufunye dedicate his life to go to jail. We need to be more radical to make these enemies to understand what we want and how we are going to get about it. Ufunye will dedicate his life. You are not insulting Chike. You are insulting the you are insulting the constituted power. Leading the movement. That is what you are doing. In case you don't know. Ijeba Kawonya Hishi. All freedom kind of fight. We are fighting for freedom. A boy are two fights. Onya Pio Risa Pio Gisi. Obona Anya Kapcha Podia. Ape Bogi Anya. Obona Eze Kapcha Podia. Ape Bogi Eze. It is two fights. We have gotten to that stage. But I am yet to see action from our brothers living in these countries where these enemies are castigating Chikidosim, calling him names and making him look like he is not the leader in the directorate of state, the head of the, the HOD. I am going to step on so many toes. And when I come to your toe, I will stand there. If you like, push me, I will not fall. Until I'm done talking to you, then I move. There are people that have contributed in one way or the other in this struggle in the past. There are people that have benefited from this struggle in one way or the other in the past. There are people that have commanded this movement in the absence of Mazen Namdekan in the past. And such people gave others that took lives of Biafrans, such as Uche Oka for Mefo. Uche Oka for Mefo is right now insulting Mazin Namdekano, insulting the struggle, saying all manner of rubbish against the movement that him which Oka for Mefo have benefited from. Which Oka for Mefo was on salary 
as the deputy to Mazen Namdekanu in this struggle for over 11 years. But let me say 10 years. Ucho Kafo Mefo got his British citizenship through this struggle led by Mazen Namdekanu. Which you for me for was on salary and he had benefited a lot. But today he has turned against the struggle. He has continued to speak against Mazen Namdekano. I have counted it about four times that I saw him on either four times or three times thereabout. I saw him on BBC Igbo. Singing like a canary against Mazen Namdekano. All the people that were killed during the Trump protests in Ugocha we are all commanded by Uchoka from Efo because Mazen Nankano was not outside. That is how the leadership works. When the leader, the leader is not there, the next person in position of the leader becomes the leader. While we reserve our own apologetically respect and love for the main supreme leader himself. But the same equal right, respect we are giving to the leader, we give it to that person who is occupying the position of the leader. And which you from before commanded. In Umpore, people were massacred. In Headbridge, people were massacred. In Ungwa High School, people were massacred. In MNA, people were massacred. Under the watch and command of Ucho Kafome for this program is not for him. I will I will say I will I will address him, I will welcome, I will bring him to the to my platform, then I will school him. But today, the same Ucho Kafome for who have given orders that killed over 300 Biafrans. Because these 300 Biafrans that died under his watch, they attributed every love, every respect of Mazen Namdekanu to him. They saw his position as he, as long as you are the deputy and Mazi is not out here, we give you the same respect. That is why he said, go. And these people, we went. I could have been dead by now because I have been, I was in Ugocha, marching on the ground. I have the video. If you want, I play it for you on this platform. You see. He commanded us to go. And before, two days before that particular protest, Intel and Intel came from one top principal officer in the Directorate of State to Uchoka for Mefo that the atmosphere is not good. Even though letter was written to the Commission of Police, letter was written to any chiefs. in Iguacha, that this is a peaceful protest. Then they plan to kill our people. And the information was brought to Uchoka from Efo. Uchoka from Efo said, no, my order goes. And the information was that that particular protest of Donald Trump should be called off. Because such protest was not supposed to be announced on air. Excuse me. It was supposed to be taken by surprise. Men are supposed to come out on the street and march, protest, then everybody goes to their houses. But it was announced. Which you got from before have announced eight times to that number. His voice on Radio Biafra, where he was announcing about that protest, is there. Recorded. Internet never forgets. Which okay for me for refuse to call off that Donald Trump Larry. And we all respected him. I was there. Live in Iguacha. Lo and behold, bullet was flying from left, right, and center. Men were falling by my right side, left side, everywhere. I could have been one of them that died because Uchuka for Mefo 
commanded us to go out and protest. Even when information was given to him that the environment was not secured, that the area is not secure, that the armies are, are rolling out their bullets, police are coming to kill. The information was brought to him. You see, there are things about which you come from before that I have not said. But each time I see him calling us IPOC, insulting Mazen Namdekano, speaking about Kama against Mazen Namdekano, I go back and look at his picture when he was deputy to Mazen Namdekano. Then I go out now and see his picture now that he is not easy to say nobody. What I'm trying to say here is this. Which of the is for is living in the United Kingdom. Which of the for have commanded people that goes out and was killed. Which of the there are families whose husband was killed because of your command. Whose wife was killed because of your command. Whose children were killed because of your command. And my question is this. We are still watching which of the for creating more damages in Biafra land. Castigating our people whom he have com com whom, whom he have commanded to go and die. And people are watch are, are looking at him, moving around freely in the United Kingdom. You see, anybody that have eaten in the king's house, drank in the king's house, lived in the king's palace, and because of his attitude, the king sent him out of the house, or he ran out of the king's house, should not, shouldn't, not should, shouldn't come back and condemn the same palace that have fed him, that he have benefited from, that have clothed him and sheltered him for so many years. If you do that, you are not you, are, you don't deserve to be to be alive. Because an ingrate is better than you. Mazen Nam Nekano, being our leader, we love him so much. And the reason why we love him is because he is a good man who cares about his own people. Mazen Nam Nekano is a good man. If the leadership of this movement is not taken serious and protected, only open a theory, see, but they move the, the, the leadership. Then on a contra, happy, why you see, we have not started. We are only talking. I'm going to hear. I'm going to look at her. Koga, I'm going to put that idea. I'm going to use you to do an example because I am a book, the head of the Rectorate of State, appointed by Mazin Namikano. I'm going to look at her. I'm going to put that who against you to do the same. I get you, I get you, you're back. Those of you that are living abroad. I'm telling you the gospel truth. It doesn't matter you When I came out to speak about Kanun Takano, Emmanuel Kano, I knew these people are close to Mazen Nam Kano as family. It does not stop my love for Mazen Nam Kano. It does not stop me from defending Mazen Nam Kano and standing with him. That is what Mazen Nankan told me to do. Mazen Nankan told me, say, it doesn't matter who the person is. It doesn't matter where the person comes from. It doesn't matter the son or the daughter of who the person is. As long as you are standing as an impediment against this struggle for the restoration of our nation, I will crush you. If you stand as a hindrance to the restoration of our nation, it doesn't matter the son or the brother or sister of who you are. I, Mazo Alizetuku, became we take on you. That is why last time when Master Prophet came out and spoke against Mazin and Kano's wife, I warned him. I told him, I said, listen, if you dare mention Mazin and Kano's wife's name again, in any of your broadcasts. I'm watching him. If you mention that woman name again, and Biafrans in Germany did not beat hell out of you, 
then I will know that Biafran doesn't have people in Germany. I said it already, Biafra. Life and the word heard my voice. And since then, nobody got weango. Mention the name of Mazenan Khan wife again. Just for once, again. Why are for This is what should be done to all those people who are fighting against the leadership of this movement. Those of you that have run away, waiting for Mazi to come out, so that if you begin to write again to clap, to share his picture. Once Mazi want to talk, all of you will jump outside. Mazi man can is our leader. Mazi man can is our leader. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're not calling you this. When you will see the beast in me, you people never see anything. It's when Mazi is released and any one of you come out and begin to support him, to talk rubbish. I will go and remind you when you left Facebook, when you left Twitter, and I will use it to... Fit. I'm keeping a lot of record on all of you. Including those that are very close to Mazen Namdekano, they can't even open mouth to write something or to say something against Mazen Namdekano brothers who are con who are who are destroying what Mazen Namdekano have built. So many of them, Unuji Unu Unu Nachuto, that is family of Mazen Namdekano. I can't say something about them. I don't know anything about them. You are a fool, Chiluke Bogoku. I know all of you. When Mazi was out, you were there. Morning, afternoon, and night, you are there. I service, I service. Since engineer Mazi, I know they see your article again, or that. I know they see your video again, or that. I know they see your contribution, your sharing, your tweet. I know they see them again. You know, your, all of you know yourselves. All of you know yourselves. This is the reason why Mazen Nandekano at times make mistakes as a human being. And I cannot blame him because he's a human being. People came to pretend like they love him. People came to pretend like they are supporting him. People came to pretend like they are, you know, doing what he wanted them to do because Mazen was outside. And Mazen will mention names. That is how Mazen got mentioned name of, of the idiot they call uh, Uwasofa. The idiot in, in France. Asnafiabu Uwasofa. Maza Oanyafa. Ndaga Negenti. Metoka boy, 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 man, ndewa naga Negenti. Mufodun ndewa Mazen kwa mwana hafa, no ndaga Negenti. Hapata ziye. If I fight, 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 if I based on information from the same people. You should get it. You should get it. But you should get it. People like Uche Uka from Mefo will come out and condemn us in the canoe live on 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 this uh, uh, on on BTV, um, not BTV, sorry, on um, BBC. Which will come from before? We be on his platform. He sought Mazen Nankano for one hour, two hours. Unu gafuya, una mankuoku, una mechiono. I have said it times with that number. Anything that you will give me, that will make me to close my mouth, that will make me not to speak the truth. About the evil you, I see you doing. Don't give it to me. If you have given it to me. And I have taken it from you. And you begin to do evil. You begin to castigate the leadership. And castigate the movement. And castigate the leader of this movement. I will gladly say. Thank you for giving me that. But for doing the evil you are doing. 
That is why I'm outstanding on that part. There was an article written by our sister, Nwadaibej Gift Amarachi. I read that article with carefulness. Ibe Gift Amarachi said that that somebody gave you something in this struggle or supported you in this struggle does not mean that you have sold your soul to that person. That the person will come to do something that is wrong. You cannot open your mouth to speak. She used herself as an example. That a particular person bought her a laptop. And later, that same person that bought her a laptop begin to go against the leadership. Begin to go against the organogram. Begin to, you know, do something wrong. That she came out. And condemn that person. And that is what struggle should be like. They have been telling me, talk about Nelly Febu, talk about Nelly Febu, talk about that. What do you know about Nelly Febu that I don't know? That you think that I know that you want me to say? Say it with your mouth. When Nelly Febu wrote, and he wrote her article that they want to take they want to take over from the US. I must have the two who came out on this platform to condemn it. I shredded her on that. I told her this is not what Mazen Nandekanu wants, and this will not happen. I stand with the directorate of state which Mazen Nandekanu put together. I cannot support any evil. I did it. But some people, some individuals that call themselves media warriors with me, because of their personal encounter with Uchoka for Mefo, they cannot open their mouth and condemn Uchoka for Mefo for once. Instead, they were embracing him. Today, Obido Bienu is insulting as a can call him a Berima. Go and listen to Obido Bienu. This is the same man that gave us the acronym of if we are not soon, man, man, yeah. Hi, this word, eh, in a small place. Now I understand the meaning of that word that says human faith is ephemeral. Human faith is ephemeral. You cannot ascertain what human being can do in the next second. Whenever he called Orido Biafra back in 2013, 14, 15, when he's want to close, his closing remark says, If Obono was you know me, man, yeah, that is to say, whatever Mazenan can ask you people to do, do it. So, because a continental rep was given to him, and he is he was one of the Principal officers, yes, in the Directorate of State. He thought that now he is dining and whining with Marcy on the same table. He now begins to underrate the powers and the authority of Marcy. That Ifobu no Sunu Menia became Ifobu no Sunu Menia. That is human being for you. And some individuals. Who are in the same struggle with me are here still telling us that they love Uchemefo, they love Obido Bien. Yes, you may love them. I am not against your love for them. But what happened? When Uchemefo and Obido Bien begin to fight against Mazen and the Kano, why don't you come outside and say, I love these people, oh, but I'm condemning what these people are doing? Uchemefo, Ki Himeri Meta here. Which of found after I can hear try also, I want when you are also, we will not be able to stop all that rubbish because if we are seeing four banana, we will say, "My man, can you see case of person be figure make it a cinema man?" They cannot do that. I did not even imagine my child, and I didn't hit anybody in this struggle. Anybody that counts himself as my enemy, 
must have disagreed with me in one truth or two truths or three that I have said to them that they cannot swallow. I am not perfect. Yes, I am not perfect. I have my own shortcomings. That is why anytime you see me sounding very vulgar, sounding very bitter, sounding very bad, something is cooking, something is happening somewhere. All of you young girls, young girlfriend ladies, that we are hovering over my son and the canon in this struggle. Sharing and writing articles here and there. Praising Mazen Nandekano to the high heavens. Now that Mazen Nandekano is under the, the, the captive of the enemy, you all have disappeared. All of you. You have disappeared. But All of you guys that always want Mazen to you use Mazen for your pictures, you change it, you press him, you write article, you put Mazen in that picture, write beautiful thing, Mazen will come and read it and like it, you'll be happy. You, oh, Mazen is a good man. Hey, Mazen is liking my page. Hey, Mazen is mentioning my name. Hey, this and that. I service. The capturing of Mazen and the have taught me a whole lot of things. And this program I'm doing, if, if when I open my line, when you are calling, the basic of your topic should be what you learn. What have you learned because of the adoption of Mazen Namdekanu so far? Can you feel what You can as well put it on the comment section for those of you who may not likely want to call. What have you learned? That is why I say power to those of you that stood with Mazen Nandekano and the Retreat of State up to this moment. That is why I say kudos to all of you that are still following the that foundation that Mazen Nandekano laid. I say kudos to each and every one of you. I pray for each and every one of you. But all of you that have left the struggle because Mazen is not longer here, waiting for him to come out before you jump out of your out, out of your out of your holes. Chinekeka ni noaku. Let me, let me educate you a little bit. You don't know that if there is no DOS in this struggle, by now, Biafra land will be like Samisa Forest. Because any animal that are moving in group without a leader are always cheap prey to the hunter. Whenever you see heads of lions or pride or heads of uh, buffalo moving, there is always one in the front moving. Go and check. Go and watch. There is always one in the front moving. That one that is moving is their king. That is their leader. You will not see anyone overtake him or her. No, no one, no one. You will always be in the front line. He's always on in animals too, pets. That one has four ears. The ones that are following him, following them, has only but two ears. The four ears is two is the one he used to listen to those that are following him. Two is the one who used to listen to danger that is in the front line. So once he's moving, he's focused. If there is any danger in the front, in the right, he take the left direction. And those, all of them will follow him, follow the animal, going to that direction that he's going. Knowing fully well, no more. That is why my slogan of follow who no road have not died. I kept it for a purpose. I will resurrect it very soon. Before the uh, before the rendition of Mazen and I was shouting, follow who no road, follow who no road, follow who no road, follow who no road, follow who no road. Some people we are confused. They say, Who is some president who became the who follow who no road? Who, who, is, who is the person that no road? I was not even referring to Mazen and because already he is the leader. I was referring to the people Mazen and left behind. 
There are those that doesn't know road. There are those that know road. Those that know road are the ones that Mazen and Kadu say, in my absence, follow them. I don't see any reason why somebody that claim to love Mazen and Kadu we begin to follow Iberimana Finland. We begin to listen to Iberimana Finland. That is why I am very, very angry with some individuals in this struggle. I'm very upset with some individuals in this struggle. But my heart is open for forgiveness. The men of Eastern Security Network, led by Mazen Namde Kano, protecting Biafra land. So many of them fell by the roadside because of the activities of Nen Nyanya that I wanted to stop on time. I will never speak without mentioning Nen Nyanya. I will continue to talk about her. I'm not waiting for Mazen Namde Kano to come out for justice to be done on Nen Nyanya because I know that when Maz once Mazen Namde Kano come out, the case of Nen Nyanya will die. A natural date. Oh, money. We are dead there and power. Men near you will not face any panel. Go and write whatever I'm telling you now. Go keep writing it down. Men near you will not face any panel. Men near you will use the case of men near you will die a natural death. But men near you have generated something that killed so many of our young youths. Because if Nenyanya had released funds for those that claimed that they were hungry because of the absence of Mazen Nam the Kano, so many of them will not follow Ekberima and die today. In case you don't know, so many of them would have been alive. And that is what I was fighting. From the beginning, that Nenyanya's activities should be checkmated. That Nenyanya's activities should be checkmated. That Nenyanya activities should be checkmated. And some individuals contacted me and said, Come outside and tell the whole world that you are lying against Nenyanya. I said, No. I will not do that. I refused. I said I will not come out to say that everything I've said about against Nen Nyanya was lie. I can't. I cannot do that. Never will I do that. Never, ever, ever will I do that. How can I? How can I? I come outside? Oh, God. Be <sighs> friends. Those of you that are falling by the roadside, stand up. Wake up. Do the needful. Support this movement. Stop being confused. So many people have died because of the activities of Nen Nyanya in this struggle. And I was penalized for it. I was seriously penalized for it. I suffered because of Nen Nyanya. People who are calling me names, lying against me. People who are castigating me. People have said all manner of rubbish. A lot of lies was said against me. Like plenty lies from left, right, and center. Things I never did, they said I did them. Things I never said, they said I said them. Things that have never happened, they say I. They put all of them on me. Because I was actually trying to save us from the danger. At the end of the day, people have died. 
Who is going to bring those people that died out back? Nobody. Nobody. Or they achieve Japan when the mother drinking on Monday, when you This way with you, my brother, from another mother. Thank you. I collected all those bullets because I wanted to salvage the situation. But today we have seen all. You just imagine what Nene have done. If any member of the any member of a, a media warrior should come out now, as I'm speaking to you right now, and begin to say, eh, I love Nene. Nenyanya is good. What will you think? Somebody called me, say, come out, please. Come and say that you lied against Nenyanya. Take all the all the blames. I said no, I will not. Because I did not lie against her. Hey, come okay, come and do the damage control now. Do the damage control. It's okay. People are no longer paying money. People are no longer paying money. These are very bad. This and that. Can you go? 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 Can you do it? Do it. Do as you do it. I say, hey. What are these people saying? I don't understand what they are saying. I should come and do damage control. Why I was trying to prevent something that is not supposed to happen. And I was, you know, called all manner of name, lied against. Then now you say, for me to do damage control, I should come out and accept what I did not do. I should come out and accept lies that were said against me. Do you know how damaged it is? The intention, whatsoever intention of that person that contacted me, it was evil intention. It was evil intention. God forbid bad thing. I will never accept what I did not do. I said, okay, with my wisdom, I'm going to handle it carefully. My apology, I said, any, anyhow, I have offended Nenya by insulting her that I'm saying sorry. To the leadership, for disobeying you people, I am very sorry. Even knowing fully well down there in my heart that I was forced to say those things, not that I, I'm supposed to say it, but I was looking at amending things and making their friends to believe in the leadership again. To make their friends to believe, to bring money out, to support what you are doing again. For me not to allow the struggle to scatter because everybody was saying that everything that is happening is because of my exposition on any nyanya that I have come to, even my brother here, Odeji, who is commenting? Who is uh, uh, commenting on this section? He's listening to me right now. He even told me the same thing. Odie, it's into a city ebe. Ibram, seem that na mwa, not because of broken smell, but as you you were very furious and angry with me. So many of you left my platform. Man, I say no mwa bo. Aba lo se angine kulungine ngo. Ezoku bundo. Ibe man ezoku kazo dia. I refuse to accept that I was wrong by exposing Nenya, but I managed to say, okay, Nenya, if I'm, I'm sorry if I have offended you in insulting you, calling you names. That was it. I should come and accept what I did not do. I said, no, I, I won't do that because I want to do damage control. No, I can't, I can't accept what I did not do. I can't accept it. Just as 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 the UJM4 is right now in South Mazin and calling IPOB IPONK. Laughing at Mazin and the nemesis have caught up with Mazin and the Kano. And somebody will continue telling you that he loves UJM4. And UJM4 is in South Mazin. And the same person is talk, telling you that Mazin is his leader. How do you balance it? How do you call, how do you connect this? That is why when I made my apology. I made it in a way that anybody that have common sense will understand. And so many of them rejected the apology. Say, no, this man have not said any apology yet. I will not accept it. I will not accept it. But today, all of them have come to realize that I was very, very right and smart at the same time. Because if I wasn't smart, I said, okay, let me come and do damage control. And I said, okay, uh, everything I said about Nenyanya, I was lying. And Nenyanya, forgive me. And they will be happy, you but today, I will not be talking to you again. By today, you will not be hearing from me again. Because that is a means to silence me completely. 
That is a means to keep me off the lane completely. What will I be telling you if I came out to tell you that I was lying against Nenia? And later, later, it came to show that I was actually saying the truth. Does that make me a puppet or does that make me a gallant man? So it's not everybody that gives you advice, that gives you advice in this struggle that you take the advice about the way the person say it. Not everybody. In some occasion, you use your sense, your common sense. So, if you are an IPOB member and you are following Mazi now, you can follow this movement up to this moment that Mazi is still in the hand of the enemy. And you are gallantly following the leadership that Mazi left behind. May Chukwu Kabema bless you for me. I was against when people are trying to clean those that have killed our people. You want to wash them clean. All in the name of, you know, looking for solution. And people who have killed Biafrans, who have committed a lot of atrocity, who have in one way or the other indulged in one criminality or the other, and you are trying to clean them, make them look good, and they want me to support you. At this point in time, I will not do that. And I am not either waiting for Mazi to come out and to fix anything. I am expecting the Director of State to do everything possibly to make sure that that Okwa Haguyel Hanaka Nyunanyu That is it. That is where I stand. If Mazenan can come out, Mazenan can will pave a fresh way. Mazenan can will create a fresh path. Mazenan can will make sure that the next step that we need to take is being taken without any hindrance, dragging him backwards. Not to inherit what we are supposed to fight with the authority he left in the hand of the leadership. No. I said Mazen Nankan is, is not coming out to inherit any rubbish. We have fought a good battle, a great one indeed, because money was pushed out to the enemies to scatter what we are doing. Money was pushed out, serious amount of money, to destroy the movement. To destroy this movement, a lot of money was pushed out. But what happened? This movement, this gallant men that are leading us, and those in the media have fought a great battle to stop it from happening. You that is listening to me, that I have spoken about your evil deed in the struggle, you are not my enemy. But if you continue your, your activities that is of evil, you count yourself as my enemy. I don't hate anybody. But believe you me, the Director of State is the authority now that we see. We are not going to be continuing saying when Mazin Nandi can come out. When Mazin Nandi can come out. That is giving the enemies the leverage to continue keeping Mazin Nandi Kanu, knowing fully well that there is something that Mazin Nandi Kanu is going to do when he come out. So that thing that Mazin will do when he come out, we are going to do it now before he come out. That is where Mazin will salute us and say, yes, I, this is the people that I trusted. That is why I leave the leadership on their hand. So when Mazin Chikedozem speaks, it becomes authority. If you like, you take it. If you don't like, you go away. We continue to march. What is the thing or what are the things that you have learned in the absence of Mazen Namdekano? My line is now open. And for those of you that want to contribute to the program, the number to call is already there. Go ahead and call. We are here. I'm going to answer your calls. Those of you that want to debate with me, those of you that want to say something negative, I am here. Honor the Jebon Baraka. But once you call me, don't forget that 
we are fighting for Biafra. And our restoration is the peak. That is the last bus stop. It's non-negotiable. Biafra restoration is non-negotiable. Amazonian can feed on is non-negotiable. Whether the enemies like it or not, we must get Biafra restored in our own lifetime. In our own lifetime, we are indigenous people of Biafra. My line is open for those of you that want to call. I know that a lot of you would like to call, so the line is open right now. You call in, you make a contribution very, very, very short. Only on WhatsApp. Only on WhatsApp. I don't have a signal line where anybody can call on this program right now. Only on WhatsApp. Somebody is calling, is asking if they can call on signal. No, this number is only on WhatsApp right now. I have signal on the phone, but I don't think I registered it. So no need of calling on signal. Only but on WhatsApp. Kedifi Mutal, in the absence of Mazin Namdekano, those of you that have run away should come back if you want to continue being, being that true lover of Mazin Namdekano. If not, count yourself out because if Mazin Namdekano come out, you come out to, to talk rubbish. I will fight a lot of you in the presence of Mazin Namdekano. There are people I'm going to fight with with Mazen, and I want, want Mazen to be watching me while fighting them. And I will be pointing out reasons why I'm fighting them. And when they know Mazen and the Kanu so, they not feel open mouth to condemn the evil of Mazen and the Kanu brothers. They cannot. They cannot. Do you know why? Because they are looking for favor. Because they want to be seen as good people. So, uh -huh, yes, Mazo Ellis is a bad person. That is why he's fighting the Kano family. I'm not fighting the Kano family. I'm fighting the stupidity in the heart of his brothers. The greediness in the heart of his brothers is what I'm fighting. And Mazi told me to do so. He said, anybody, if you want, I will play the voice where Mazi and can declare that if you are an impediment to the restoration of Biafra, it doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter where you come from. You will be destroyed completely. Mazi, Mazi did not say, even if my brother didn't do it, don't, don't do that. No. He made it open, categorically clear, that whosoever that is going to be a hindrance to the religion of our nation should be fought. And that is what I'm doing. So if the brother or the sister or the friend or whoever falls into it, I clear you and will continue to move. That is why I am Mazo Elizabeth Chukubi came. I go be a friend came and I be a friend. We feel when he meet me, Mazo Baka Zonia. Mazo soja di me di different. Ungo ge zio ko mo li figure ni we we ge hog transformer. And to all of you, those of you that are double agents, you come, you talk about Biafra today, tomorrow you talk about another thing. Those of you that are using the struggle to get to, to chase clout, to get followers, when you get followers, you think that people are not listening to you, then you switch. We are taking note of all your activities. Yes. We are taking note of all your activities. All your activities, we are taking note. Now, I want to play the voice of Mazen Namdekano that have empowered me to fight anybody that is trying to stop what we are doing. Like anybody at all, it doesn't matter who you are, as long as you are doing something that is going to drag us backward, I will fight you. Mazi instituted it, and Mazi made it as a law, and I, I stand on that. So I don't need to take permission from the leadership to fight anyone who is trying to drag us backwards. We cannot continue to make ten, uh, five, five, uh, um, five steps forward and ten, step back, uh, ten steps backward. We can't continue like that. I want you to pay attention. Without fear before our enemies, we have sworn an oath to restore Biafra, or we die in the process. There will be no retreat and no surrender. If the option they give to us is to seek our restoration by violence, the every living thing living in the zoo will be destroyed. All the animals will be destroyed. It's a promise and a pledge we're making to them. They must understand that we just don't love our country. We are fanatical about Biafra. 
we will do everything humanly possible to ensure that Biafra comes. It is either the flag of Biafra is raised up or I am lowered into the grave. One of the two must happen. It is better for this heaven and this earth not to exist than for Biafra not to come to pass. We dedicate it into the hands of Chukwabiyama, the creator of the heavens and the earth, because only him decreed that we should exist as a race, and only him has the say to decide and to determine if we are to survive or not. We don't rest our hopes in any man. We don't believe that any country can do anything for us. We are going to reaffirm our faith in the supremacy of the creator of the heavens and the earth, Chukwabiyama, upon to whom and in whom every glory and honor belongs to. That's why we worship him and nothing else and no other. We worship the one true living God. That is who we worship. That is why we were created. We are not like any other people. We have been chosen by Chukwabiyama to serve him. We have been chosen by the creator of the heavens and the earth that we may serve him. That is why in our names which contains every praise imaginable. Every praise imaginable to the Most High is contained within our names because we are very special people. We are here to reaffirm and reiterate that. We are here to ensure that this very march towards our freedom cannot be hindered. Any obstacle on our way, real or imagined, man or woman, adult or child, anything it is, once you are an impediment to the restoration of the sovereignty of Biafra, you will be destroyed completely. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? This is the day that I, Mazo Pelezich, will become decided as did, uh, upon the declaration of this world from Mazin Namdekano that it doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter where you come from. It doesn't matter the son or the daughter of who you are. People have died for the sake of the struggle. People, have, people are in prison right now. People are, have been slaughtered. People's houses have been burnt down. A lot of people cannot even visit their villages. A lot of people were carrying bullet wounds on their legs. Chidozie Onora is carrying bullet wound on his leg today. That leg is damaged completely. And Mazenan can declare that anything real or imagined that want to stand on our way, we will destroy you completely. That is the word of Martin Namdekano. In case you don't know. So when you see me come out and fight anybody that is trying to be an impediment to the restoration of our nation, I am doing it because of this declaration of Mazi. And he sanctioned it. So you that is Come on, you are looking for favorism. You are looking for uh, uh, alliance. You are looking for favor from uh, Mazen and the Canon family. And you saw them doing something wrong that is going to be an impediment to the restoration of our nation. And you keep quiet. You keep quiet. All of you that are looking for favor. Because you want to be noticed, you want maybe you are thinking if Mazenan can come out tomorrow, then you will be able to go close to him. When, as I'm talking to you right now, there are things I have decided. If any name will okay, there's there is time for everything. There is time for everything. I believe that the time for evangelism on the ground have come and gone. We don't need any evangelism on the ground again. Every nook and cranny of Biafra land is saturated with the gospel of redemption. Everybody knows about Biafra. Everybody knows about Mazen Amikano. If you call for a referendum today, it is 99.9%. .9%. The remaining 0.1% that, that, that will not be there is maybe somebody like Chukwoka of Ebu. Maybe he's the only one that would like to join his full and people because he cannot come to Biafra land and live again. Ever until he die. So, looking at what I am talking, to, what I am telling you guys about, if indeed Mazen Nandikano speaks this way, because people have died, people are suffering, people are in prison, 
People are carrying bullet wound. What else do you think is going to scare me from saying it the way it is? Nothing. I repeat, nothing. I have a call on the line. Caller, welcome to this program, as the Hot. Yeah, no matter where you're calling from. Yeah, as the Hot. As the Hot, good morning. Not as the Hot, yeah, good morning. You should, say, you should say, as the Hot, now so you go talk to me. Now so, now as the Hot, now so I go talk to Thank you, go ahead. Miss you work. Go ahead. Yes, um, I, I, I will not say my name at this uh, moment because I'm in the zoo right now. So... I want to uh, chip in something based on what you are saying. You see, in this struggle of uh, Biafra, when we took an oath, we didn't took an oath to defend uh, um, someone who, who is not who is not uh, part of Biafra. We took an oath to to defend Biafra. Even if you are my brother, the same blood. I mean the same mama, the same papa. I can give a damn concerning this struggle. If you are not one of us in IPO, I don't know you. And if you are not with the uh, um, DOS, I can't defend you. I don't know you from other. It's just simple, it's just simple thing. You know, our people have been fooled by this, uh, all these people, both the experiment and co, they, are, they, are, they have been fooled. And then we can continue the fooling ourselves. It's very simple. When we took our oath, we didn't took oath from Eberima. We didn't took oath uh, to, to, to Mazenam, the colonel's brother. We didn't took, I didn't took oath, okay, from my brother or from my mother. So this thing is all about Mazen Nan the Kano and uh, DOS. So people who have who has took who has took oaths, they should go back. It was stated there. The two things I saw is Mazen Nan the Kano and DOS. There is no other. So anybody who is going contrary to that, you are not in fact you are not you are not an IPOB member. It's just, it's just as, simple, as simple as that. All what? those people parading themselves with a Berima and Co. They are, they are not an IPOB member. What have you that, learned? That's the way I see them. What have you learned from the absence of Mazin Namdekano so far? Two minutes and round up. My brother, thank you for this question. You know, it has given me hope and uh, strength. Okay? It also has it has made me to understand my enemy, to, to know who my enemy are. It, it makes me to know who, who my enemy are. That is what I learned from the access of modern and the farm. No, nothing else. Okay, thank you very much. Thank very you, much. my brother. Thank you. Thank you. You see, in this struggle, we have only about two types of people here. I have said, I have said the times with that number. Those that watch things happening and those that make things happening. It's either you belong to those that watch things happening or you belong to those that make it to happen. And those that make it to happen are those that are fighting according to the instruction of Mazinam. But those who are watching it happening are those that are not men enough. I have another caller on the line. Caller, welcome to this program. I see the Let me we are coming from this. Uh, good afternoon, brother. Welcome to the program. Hello? Your, your name and where yeah, you're calling from? Uh, sorry, I don't know. Uh, yeah, my name is uh, CJK. Hello, CJK. Uh, I need that uh, audio that is just played. I don't know how to call you, please. Okay, write me a message. Just write me a message. He needs the audio of Mazin Namdekano. One of the best speech of Mazen Namdekano that motivated me like 10 million times is what we heard. Welcome to the program, Asi Dehot. Your name will come from, please. My name is Joseph. Asi Dehot, Nasa Gotoka. Go ahead, please. Good afternoon, fellow Biafra. Good afternoon, Asi. 
I want to make a contribution based on what you have learned on this uh, on this uh, this period that our leader has been kidnapped. I must say that it's a very good time. You have two minutes. Bad way, but well, you have two, that our leader has been going. You have two minutes to do so. I have two minutes to do so. Go ahead. Two minutes. Okay. So we I, I learned a very good thing because. It, it, what is has been happening, it, it seems that uh, we at to be, we haven't been questioning so many things. But I believe now is the, the time that you have been, we need to be questioning so many things. In short, of, uh, I know that our leader have left it, those, that issue for us to be questioned before, but we ignored it. Based on how can somebody be in a treasurer in organization without giving an, a breakdown of, uh, of uh, expenses and income for so many years? And we just everybody just keep quiet and look over it like nothing happened. Now that they come up, the issue has come up, it, 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 it become a problem. That is not how things have been done. I believe that we should be questioning so many things. Understand? And the issue of uh, so many hero worshippers that believe that uh, uh, cannot that cannot can come and do anything. Uh, uh, it's cannot that uh, even paying his dues that you come and take a, come and think that you will become a control the organization whereby it's not even a and a coordinator, unit coordinator. Is he even paying his dues that he would think that uh, the, the, the struggle is for Kanota family? You see, in this struggle, if any person, if any say we can work out for many person, whether it's uh, our Bible uh, HOD, we, we're going to share the other person. This struggle has taken so many lives. So we are not joking. And for now, we need to be pressuring so many things that is not uh, dedicated to the struggle. So that is my contribution, and that is what I learned. For so many mm -hmm. years that have been rich, we haven't been questioned so many things. And for now, it's like we need to be questioned so many things that is happening in between the organization, between this IPOB. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. And before you question anything, you, mu you must make sure that you are a member of IPOB family. Okay? You must make sure that you are a member of IPOB family. You can't question from outside IPOB. You must go through your coordinator. Welcome to the program, I see the hot. Your name and where you calling from? Uh, my name is uh, Prince Will Ike Chuku. Are you going to say it as the hot? I'm calling. Uh, I'm calling from uh, Austin, Texas. Are you going to say it as the uh, hot? Yes, I will. I will definitely. Go ahead. You see, uh, let me just. Hello. Go ahead and speak. The word is Hello? listening. Okay. You see, let me just make this thing clear. Let me make it clear. Uh, I thank the DOS for their work. I have never doubted you from the beginning. Even the first, <clears throat> the first, uh, 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 this thing, in Tal Zoom, The, it's your for that first first period. That is when actually I started following you. Then it's the way they where they actually kidnap in the canoe. I have never doubted you. You see, in Nigeria, I have never seen an organization where there is no auditing, where you don't, where a, a financial institute do not accept auditing from from the leader. If he now become out, I will ask him this question personally. That how is the, the, how come? Is it that a financial distinction cannot be audited? Which organization does such thing happen? You don't audit a, a, a financial minister in an organization. She refused to be audited. Okay. Are you getting the file now? Okay. Now, that aside, when you see Kanun uh, Takanun, is contracted by Nigeria government. Canon Takano is working with with Simon Ima. They are having a a, a three man a chat on WhatsApp with a see a Joe and a, a and Simon Ima. They are working. Not a Joe Not a Joe Four. Not a Joe Four. Ejimako, correct yourself, please. Not a Joe Four. Ejimako, sorry. Ejimako, mm -hmm. it was a slippery of tongue. Mm -hmm. They are having. You see the, the whole mayhem happening in Ibu land is Kanunta, Aloy, and uh, Simon. Uh, these three people who are involved, deeply, deeply down involved in it. 
Quote me, carry me go any day I will swear. They are deeply, because they, let me tell you why the whole thing open up within themselves. Now that comment where uh, 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 Senator, Senator Abaribe make for that, uh, for that Senate forum, where you say, when you say that Inam the Kana have already told him since 2021, that this sit, over, sit, sit at home something is he's not involved in it. He doesn't know anything to do with it because he don't give authority to the to the leadership that they should stop it. Are you getting the? Are you getting me? Now tell me what did you learn because of his absence? Now, I yes, I learned that we should be diplomatic as media warriors. We should be diplomatic in our broadcasts. We should actually work on the broadcast based on our favor. And we should not allow uh, some mistakes around around us because mistake is about to happen happens in the in the organization. We should not come on air and make it open. Are you getting it? We should learn how to cover mistakes within ourselves. Thank and you. there should be one one particular uh, circle that 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 gives information on what the media warrior should be should be broadcasting thank especially. You. Thank, so, you. thank you, thank you, thank from you. The DOS. It's okay, thank you. Thank you, my brother. You made a very valid point here. In a movement of this kind, everybody who is in the media should be in a round table where any topic that is discussed should be treated before bringing it to the public. So that anybody who thinks he's too big not to be in that gathering should not be speaking for the for the struggle no. because the person will be causing problems for us. That is the point this no. my brother is saying. Welcome to the program, please. I remember where you're calling from. Oh, my one name. Deo. What would you know for? I'll go on a pizza. Pizza is a bomb guitar. Huh? Or pizza in on a foot on a non beza. No, I wouldn't hold my pizza. Okay, but go ahead. Go ahead and speak. Um, I hear that I saw what I told you. Shall Jock Nobi? You should be. I like the mirror. And all of those who don't know the Kamuai, she called him. Yeah. You know what I'm Yeah. Um, you know, I'm not going And, um, this is a struggle. Um, and what they are catching on. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, the Kalu, of course, that's not. No, I'm in our game. You didn't take Jack. Only a potter. And what boss that no no only on the sort of IPOD? I get a motor diapo. No, I won't remember of IPOD. In Jacky Richam, who were Manadu, a shamezi here. Our Yarika and a cage is a magic cage. May not an IPOD, get a monoku, eat a piece. And we're going to have an IPOD, but him more. Because of only another IPOB, and as now only another IPOB, or go there, Apata de Baku, we have just you go out because of some foolish people who are not here, Gana, Gana, only another, not that simulation. It's a little bit because all is only in Africa, I want somebody on a Nasa, and as only by Jalu, 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 Chalo no you poke with chalo chalo hold on. I was not for Joby. You poke you poke here with Nobi. It happened to us. You poke on Kedi and Nobi. Yeah, you know. I'm mad at you. Yeah, you know. You know. You know. You I'm saying. I'm saying what is in my mind now. Because chalo, chalo. Now I'm going to give time to speak. But listen, I have to moderate. I have to. I have to moderate you. But I will give you time to speak. And then I like coming on our bank account. I jump over two minutes here, Kumana, because of topic you were talking about now. I'm going to five or ten minutes. 
based on the idea of And okay. I, want, I want people to pay attention. Topic here, you can get a new policy. You can get a new policy. You can get a new policy. You can get a Yes. Good. How many organizations came out of Biafra? How many? Can I add again? Can I add again? Good. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Good. 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 Ni yop no yop na geme, we yop ta biafra, yop ta biya mea ya. Apo nan, onda hapo ti bi imi ya, heko siri ja fa ma asi we ene emi ya, ka heko siri ne emi ya, nou ta afan ke hama, bezo ni ha cho li ime, a ju kan jroge, ka ina abo mwa yezo koto se loko. Ok, em, ima na, ima na, yes or no, heko siri ja fa ma asi, a ju kan na jroge, this platform is And I like them giving with the moral when put a cook was ready to be. Kaizo, Kaibo, my Yazoo. Mazuku, so you are going to be a game with a Biafra, Bia, 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 Um, because So, this IPOB and is the head of IPOB. So, anybody who wrote the person the head of this organization, and I tell he is where they are gonna. I will be near human rights initiative. Hassan Hana fight for Biafra. I'm not going to be here. Look at that. I am where Zion Biafra Zion Zion movement. I'm not going to be here. Look at that. I am where the Afarensis. I'm not going to be here. Look at that. Don't even know the name. Can Hassan have low one? I just hear one. I'm not going to be here. Look at that. A brother took one to Who was once a member of IPOB? Mechara form one. Keha. Lonim. Ko abron keha. I'm also me behind the guitar. Now, who was like a bo Kenyan masob Komel? I'm also me behind the guitar. The only movement, but since I'm the canon on this year, who wani nema ne bo puti fai ne yoku ne me ko wamali fai na acho ne fai chon keta abo Indigenous People of Biafra IPOB. But as I say again, get me kona Biafra. But as I say again, get to kona muru mwai. Manakita, onyo apu na potera na eme ni ane eme ko ngota ngota ra ibiafra. Kwe siri ikredi his or her own organization o ihobu na ocho lebe ya wela fa yangwa wene eme ya. So that apu no me mistake nde ne esu ya afu ya. Ona eme ofuma nde ne esu ya aneke ni ya. Nka uma azi wwe potera. Obu yangwa bo nyi isi mwere nde ni ana azu ana o directorate of state o we liki kenye were se ha we se ayi mo bunde ne ni ne so ze ase ya nunu le kwa na ku nunu na afogim no kwa directorate of state ko nga ne so so o were another person another movement ka bi kwa inside ipob were kwa for mas nan kan we go ipob we na eku na ha na cho nwere onwe o di ko ga enwisi because on we for to handle i go re say ya enye ndi ipob on we for to handle e were kwa enye ndi ipob Oko se hali ya upe kene na haa metalia. Heliku, heliku upa yetu ota na haa dalia. So kenuzi, ebi na aga kita. Niji kwa msimu, donyo wapu napata urafa mazi. Nao jitu nae mwenye isi. Mwenye emia kwa mwote biafra. Wairis nanda ima wapu ndi isi ku direct of state. Leba chike dozi emu. Obo na chike dozi emu daba, DOS daba, aga sino IPOB. So achon kiko wongo kwa wafuma ka ima rebisa apata. Um, um, 
I want Simon Epa to create his movement, which he claim, which he should call his own, not call Mars and the or IPOB. Let us see. I never welcome to the program as the hot. I know where you calling from. Ah, uh, my name is the hot. Yes, I go talk up. Now, so good afternoon from me. Good afternoon from you. I want me. No, I have my chuku work. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Yes. I want more, uh, by our I'm not don't know. He our leader who should be our leader who should be for how many years? And we have Madame Matrana. Only many women. That brother could go to Nolo. Ask your grandma, Nolo, Monia, for it. A little she could go to the jobs. Mugum will make it. you to my brother, my brother, listen to me. Uh, you, you know, whenever, 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 you, whenever I face this camera, it's not the same Mazo Eleze that you know of camera that you see here. The spirit of Biafra takes over. Yeah. The moment you call, I know where you're going to. Open now, sometimes the people may have poor Ngwahi Hajj of Yuku. I got sick. Who's kind of woman being is this? But I allow him to watch his dating in his outside. I allowed him to come out open so that we will hear from him. Go up any Kampala food to me. Okay, for the country, you are to do. Okay, for the phone answer. I'm a mother, a JB, a Beriman, the land there. So, or to the Ebus or Buto, a Beriman, no, if you were. Nanga be a curriculum. Or the new one in Nanya. Now, these people, Bunde, a Beriman, a mamma, a machine, a Beriman, do not know the Afamas in the country where you are. I can't get it. Mas bico, um pouco muito tudo mal, estamos hoje hoje o, dá um dia o, o na fogonha não, a hava não dá cola no lai, é o, é o irmão de busu monai, welcome to the program as the hot, é não é onde é que ele está, a não é que ele é o nyuku, a não é que ele é o gente, quando aí o moço a não é que ele é o mobiafra, a não é que ele é onde chora, o amalalibo, acho muito o menino do azul asa mo na minata, dete mire 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 no mire mire ala, atro shola nyubu ugoni ya, le kile mo shau ubi ya kona nyubu, imani hili afu yeshi, atro kaja, imani hili utemo wao, this paper magi nde hano limi anta, magi hela beta duara hanta le buha, na dake kia, hela dake kia ukala, aboriri kuchiri wendo, beto, yuo mo hili utemo wao, kila kuma kama mwa, mwa chuo mo shau mwa kama, kuma kala geta wewe, na ni hili state na, chini kwenye national game. Government Karobi, 
this but this guy up for there. Hey man, but this guy laugh at that. Don't laugh. I want to come here. And so some people know that place. Like government has not been there yet. This is the OG. So we not believe him. But no, my mom, we not believe. But don't you want to hear this guy like me? Like I get the confused. See me big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we are. I can't blame money, she but you. You're not sure you're not me. You're not me. Oh, I'm not sure. Even that girl, I can't see you like me. You're me. This only she. No, no, I'm not sure. This guy is not. To this guy, she won't be with you. Dear sir, so get the audience to hear. You're quite too cool, man. I know I'm quite too cool for my best. Go job, like me. Oh, I'm not too cool, yeah. Oh, guy, I'll walk on the moon. I'm going to years. I'm not going to drink alcohol. I'm not going to drink alcohol. You want to go? Ne. Why don't you go? Because if we're going to marry, I don't know how we see each other. before I want to educate him and I know he's listening um, when the market brought before what do I do to stop this boy uh, when the market brought before I will enter you again I bought in gas you I did not hate you man uh up on a someone in our support come look you was actually Makana, after he be a mention over here, we go see that the one nanti. Obu no ana chongwero mo biafra. Oga sisi busu mo biafra. Ogo yonda kana abu mo biafra. Obu no chro kabiafra bezio kunezio. Nda ona abu busi ingo kwa idi ana same one ebele maburuwa idi mene nugu state. Listen the boys here, abu mo idi idi mene nugu state. Ingo abu no mezio ku. Obu no o o gucha zende mo ana chro biafra. Oye kogi hoteliya. On when he can stand on his own, where is he now? A fight for Biafra. Poor you, Fifi. You two was a rotor pilot. Or that rotor pilot happy for my Zimbabwean Kamafa. Happy for IPO Biafra. Happy just yaku Biafra is for all of us. On when you move it, or for my Zimbabwean Biafra. Kere zio kuka yuko bezi yuko. Mana kamba ge IPO bi my Zim bidolia. So yama bidon ki yapo on ki rotor pilot. And bidon on ki from from scratch. All they are make money with your money, we be there. So, can you see here when we are sitting on a job, we are doing what we need to do. So, can you see here when we are sitting on a job, we are doing what we need to do. So, can you see here when we are sitting on a job, we are doing what we need to do. So, can you see here when we are sitting on a job, we are doing what we need to do. So, can you see here when we are sitting on a job, we are doing what we need to do. So, can you see here esse mo o bodo moza esse mo o bodo moza bem que na apoge ganhou o menino olha a dele que na mama olha a dele o motinho que nem nem deu para dar o beijo na na é me cai um ano o ano na mama esse mo no gado o logo aí gado o logo do nariz se que o é o pia fala a dona então é muito mais na cara que o chão aqui se na lá pia fala Asum chukuo kwenye kreli guani wani apopo taraya kuhudhani na alaji ya fra yobi kuyeni yogulogo na risi kwa na pot taya kuhudia dhani na alaji ya fra kwa kula ni na kwa taka kamili chukuo kwenye kumera istu barubu ni bidhaa hachukuo kikati ya my bread he says oh maze iyam chali ukui tu ni ya hano dato mano kuchara uku sana pro pro para ekperima na your platform yes that my uroko kwa sisi Bad man, oh, I, oh, I need to find you in the wind, dear. 
No one is up for Taramas and Mande Calco or I don't need to see. Look, the military of Prodat, why come Patrana your platform? Why come Patrana your platform at this program? In that, in that, then, all the Magwam, so this is a useless human being, and then, then, not the same people. I wouldn't have a bone, my apple for Taramas and Mande Calo. Oh, one year, a little for Taramas and Mande Calo. Mas and Mande Calo, you call Kiki, who chinate Kaihoa, and our own prophet, the God. Bring to deliver us. Our money that no one that you walk in can't pay for it. Now they can't afford to deliver it. I am. I will. Any other than I get a four dollar one name. I want four money in the the lower. Idiot, I believe you. You are very much poor. You are not very much here. I am one of the lowest of that experiment. You are very much a potter. But you know, I would not want to go. We will not afford to pay for it. The spirit in you will tell you this person is here for. Immediately, Mudi, Mudi. Your network is not good in Mozambique. When you can call us back, your network is not good because your voice is easy go. And oh God, rock! I'm just going to mention so. Welcome to the program as the host. Where you're calling from? Your name. I've answered your call. Can you speak, please? At the host, at the host. Speak louder. Well, go ahead. Your name, please. Stop listening to yourself. At the host, as soon as we talk. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead and speak. Stop listening to yourself. Ndewo. This person is listening to himself. He will talk. He will wait to listen to himself before he talk again. And I don't, I can't, I don't have that kind of time to waste. Yeah, Maz, you continue. Hello. Yeah. Welcome, my brother. Go ahead. Your name and where you calling from? I'm from Barcelona. I'm from Barcelona. I'm yeah, that's like it because there's a topic you are, you are treating, you are asking our people, what lesson do they learn? And I want them to be making that impact. Anybody who wants to call will tell us one le lesson he learned mm. in this our absence of our leader. Yes, okay. <laughs> Yeah, because now we, are, we, have, we have gone so far that now we'll be taking everything. Our people will be, be, be learning something. Just like the other guy who called that now, one thing he learned that as a, as IPOB IPOB member, you have, you have right to ask some question. Mm -hmm. And if you want to ask that question, we have channels. Yes. You have to go to your to, to your coordinator okay, okay, and ask that Kambali, question. Yeah. That is the very okay, thing. Okay. Yeah. Exactly, exactly. Yes, yes. So that's a good point you have raised. We should be asking, asking some some certain questions, but you have to go to right channel. Mm -hmm. You don't ask the direct. You don't go to your number one. You have to belong to you. Have, uh, you have to belong to the movement. You have to register in the movement as a member before you ask such question. You can't just come from nowhere and exactly. asking question. Exactly. Go ahead, Mazi. Okay. Uh, as for me, we have been in in the strong for a long time. There's not nothing really new. I learned because we have been there. Our leader told us, even though he has been lowered below, below six feet, we keep on moving. Of course. I have seen betrayal. I have seen all those things. But me, I myself, find two people that God, two people in this struggle, those that God brings by himself, and those who come for one reason or the other, those who God brings in this struggle, no matter whatever happens, they remain with that truth. Yes. There's no cheating. There's nothing they can do to them to, to make them shiver. Because they have seen betrayal, they have seen wickedness, they have seen greedy. They have, we have seen a lot of things. But our hope and trust is in, in our God. That's correct. That God is who we look, look on to. So our, our new brothers who are coming in, put your trust in God. I, I, still, I still can't believe why people still listen to uh, someone. But sometimes, is it a sham this guy used to be? Because the truth, truth is very clear. Yes. I can't believe when somebody talk about this, this guy. Mazi, it makes me crazy. Mazi, let me tell you, there's, oh. a, there's a charm. There's a charm. And that charm is the name 
of Mazin Nandikan that he is using. That is the charm. Apart from that, there's no other charm. The, the charm is the name of Mazin Nandikan that is used frequently, claiming that he wants to save Mazin Nandikan. Now it is open that the person he came to save is telling him, don't save me. I'm not interested in your save. If saving me is to kill other people that I am fighting for, then leave it. There. Don't mention my name. That is the charm. Because the name of Mazen Nankan by yeah. Fumane Longwe, I said it many years ago, uh, many months ago, that if this guy can stand on his own with his name and his group to talk about Biafra, that I, be I believe you me, within 48 hours, 93, in fact, 97% of his followers will leave him. The remaining few percent exactly, will be within exactly. the and the, 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 the That is it. So, Mazi, thank you very much. I want you to round up so that I'll answer more calls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done. Thank you very, very Thank much. You. Thank you very much. We are here. And um, uh, the line is even open for auto autopilot um, Simon and my followers. So you can call in. Yes, welcome Hello? to the program. Yeah. I'm Don Chris. Uh, uh, I don't hear me. This is not how to call in the program. You can't just call say I'm Don Chris. I can't hear me. When you call my program, you have to at least say I see the hot now. So you go talk him. Where you are calling from, and uh, you know uh, you have to address people that are watching. The world is watching. I will you say I'm Don Chris. I can't hear me. It's not. It's not a way to make contribution on this platform. So on that note, I will not answer your call. Until you you are you call in and address us properly, okay? I'm donkey. So when I name me, as if na in the web we are not joking here. We are talking about a nation here. We are not talking about a village meeting or a kingdom where you can say I am this person. And when I name me, I see the drama. The drama cannot when I want to No, that is not how. That is not. Some of you doesn't know how to address people in the public. You must, as a matter of fact. Address those who you are who you who you are talking to with respect. Nobody boy say I'm only the other. Okay, na niye niye. Yeah, no, it doesn't it doesn't apply in this on this platform. I caught your call to speak so that you can hear me. So when you call again, no matter what you want to say, whether you are in support or against of Mazen Amdekano, whether you are like my boy or whatever, I don't care. I will address you. I will talk to you. I will give you time. But once you begin to go out of point, I will not think that my platform is for you. So the line is still open for those of you who want to contribute. And I want to say something here before another call comes in. You see, this guy who is always using the name of Mazen Namdekano to commit crime, since Mazen Namdekano have given order, made it very clear, don't use my name. Even he gave, even though he gave the order a long time ago, and the people he gave the order because they have the same business with the same epidemic. They couldn't announce it. They couldn't say it. You have made it open. Don't you ever use my name in committing any crime. I am not in support of sit at home. Be it Monday, be it any sit at home, apart from the one that I sanctioned. So any sit at home should be cancelled since that very day, Ekberima have not gotten himself. So that motive, that motive of I am doing it for Mazi. I'm doing it for Mazi. Mazi have come to say, you are not doing it for me. I am not interested. Stop. Don't you people see that the whole tension is down? Don't you people see that people are going their normal businesses? So where is, is, is one week and two weeks uh, uh, sit at home? Where is it? Is it not a dead, a, a, a dead issue? It is a dead issue. Because even that makes Nigeria government to understand who is the commander of Biafran's uh, IPOB, both home and abroad. Who, who speak and the Igbos listen? That is Martin Namdekan. Only his, 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 his written note is what our people saw. And we listened to those he sent to come and tell us the truth. People like Enyin Nyabaribe, people like Barisifan Yejofo, and everywhere is calm. There's no longer sit at home anywhere in Biafra land. People are going out, doing their normal businesses on the order of Martin Namdekan. Martin Namdekan gave order. He gave order. He said, I don't want any sit at home. Anybody who is doing sit at home is using it to commit crime on his name, on him, for himself, not for me. So I don't want it. And Biafra have listened. Go to Abba. Ali Abba is bubbling today. 
Nko ne we is bubbling. Obo e te nu we is bubbling. Go to, what do you call it? Go to O2. Uh, 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 people are going their normal businesses. This is a new, this is a new city. Ke mba no, ti ni wuka ifo. Yi ti ni wuka ifo. Obo no, ni chok pobita boys in the, iji ya bobo sin de mad. Pobita no haka ifo. Because, <laughs> it is not business as usual. So on this note, I am your brother, man. So I will continue to tell you the truth. It doesn't matter how painful it is. All of you that are being or that are falling by the side, or those of you that are on the face peeping, come as a pataki with after and make you need nature. Unde mona halo unine. On my back, those of you, some of you, doesn't know that I have saved the last time you talk about Mazi Namdekan. Those of you don't know, I packed it the last time you talk about Biafra. The last time you are in in in, in the same lane with what you are doing. I, we, are, we are keeping record. When the time comes, I hope that you go see you. You better go. So that is it. I think this person is going to be the last caller of the of the day. Caller, welcome to the program. Your name and where you calling from? I see the hot. That's why I go talk. Up. Thank you very very much. Go ahead. Ma okay. Yeah, Ma yeah. I thank you for all you are doing. I will have to be brief because my lunch break is almost over. Uh, I've been trying to call in. So just to go straight to what you, you the question you asked, that what have we learned yes. uh, from what has happened since uh, Mazi was taken, was kidnapped. My name, uh, by the way, is Onyeka. I'm calling from United Kingdom. Um, the, the, mo the most important thing I learned are the following. One, I learned how deep IPOB was infiltrated. I never knew IPOB could be, could be disinfiltrated. When the Mazona Nikanu was kidnapped, I now know how deep rooted the infiltration was. And I also realized, just as Emma just said, uh, um, in a broadcast he made two weeks before he was kidnapped, that IPOB uh, is facing arrays of enemies. It's not very clear to me that indeed that was true, that uh, we are really facing array of enemies. However, I also uh, it also became clear uh, to me how formidable IPOB is. I know IPOB was formidable, but what has happened in the last few years has proven to me beyond doubt that indeed IPOB is formidable. That's correct. And indestructible, as Ramazi said. Understood. You know? Yes. And I think this fact is what the agent provocateurs, uh, the so called principalities and powers, have learned now the hard way. And I hope they will now realize that there's no going back in our quest. That whether they, uh, they like it or not, no matter what they throw at us, Biafra shall be restored as a sovereign nation. That's correct. And it's indeed um, IPOB led by Mazin Nandikanu and DOS that will achieve this restor restoration of Biafra. And uh, lastly, another thing I, I, I realize is that DOS is Mazin Nandikanu and Mazin Nandikanu is DOS. That's the correct. two cannot be separated. That's correct. And I've come to appreciate also the place and the role of DOS in this struggle. To be honest with you, I believe deep down my heart that without DOS, we will not have a struggle. Of course. And that is the that is my own belief. I the deep really believe. And uh, because that's why we as IPU members, no matter what, we must stand by that leadership. And that's why what Martin Nalikon saw when he said that in my absence, listen to DOS. Whatever DOS say, whatever Achike Dozian said, goes. goes. It's not as if Mazi Achike Dozian or Martin Nalikon are no human and they cannot make a mistake or something like that. But I would like to draw an analogy here with what happens in the Catholic Church. When they say the Pope is infallible, it doesn't mean the Pope cannot make mistakes. But when the Pope is talking as the head of the Catholic Church, 
what they believe is that he's infallible. So the same way, if Mazishige does it, he's a human being, but once he's talking as a leader of DOS, he is infallible. We have to follow him and protect that structure because without DOS and without leadership, the struggle is gone. That's correct. So uh, finally, I will now leave it at this by saying that I was highly disappointed how, uh, you know, not meant to insult anybody, how um, um, I, I used to rate their friends very high that they are very intelligent, you know, but I'm kind of a bit disappointed that due to um, our emotion, most of us became gullible. I didn't know that uh, Biafran can be this gullible because I don't know that, um, you know, looking at what has happened with these infiltrators, I don't know, chief infiltrators and all those things, everything is clear that these people never meant well for Martin and the Kano and our struggle. And I don't know why people, uh, you know, even listen to him. I don't, you know, it doesn't make sense to me most of the time. I used to think that our people are more sensible, but sometimes I, I start feeling that maybe I overrated uh, our people. Or is it, is it because they are really emotionally, uh, you know, they put so much, so much emotion into Biafra, so they now became vulnerable for an idiot to be taking them for, for a ride, you know? So I will leave it at this, uh, at this point, Marzi, and I would like to thank you for all you do. Thank you, um, IPOB leadership. Thank the media warrior. Thank every principal officer in IPOB and um, every member of IPOB and also Biafra in general for supporting this struggle during this uh, trying period and to let them know that just as Marzina Nikano said in his broker two weeks before he was kidnapped, that we are going to defeat all these arrays of enemy without failing. And I believe that there is a light at the end of the tunnel and that by God's grace, Mazi will be released soon yes. and we'll continue our march to freedom. Yes. Thank you very, very God much, my you. brother. And this is going to be the last caller of the day because his call made a lot of sense. And I love people when they call and they put their word rightly and correctly. So everything you have said here is going to make my day. Anyone that listens to this program and listen to the last point must learn something. We are indigenous people of Biafra. We are freedom fighters. We are fighting to restore our own nation, not a land that belongs to someone else. Amazin Namdekan is our supreme leader. Biafrans, we are not going to continue to say we will wait for Mazin Namdekan to come out and fix things that are spoiled. We will fix them before Mazin Namdekan come out. So that Mazinan can come out, he will not inherit any backlash situations or issues that is there. We know that when he come out, there are some changes he may make. There may there will, there will be some declaration and some corrections. But let us stop using that phrase that when Mazin come out, Mazin come out because the enemies are capitalizing on it, keeping him so that he will not come out and do that which we were all expecting him to do. Let them let it not look as if the Directorate of State is incapacitated. Let it not be as if they are weak. Let it not be as if they cannot do anything. Of course they are not weak. Of course they respect Mazen Nam Kano's leadership. Of course they love Mazen Nam Kano and the anything they are doing must be according to Mazen Nam Kano's wish. But that doesn't mean that we will not continue to deal with any nonsense that we see on our way. If you are a media warrior and I see you going astray, I will speak to you. I will talk about you. If you don't want to change, I will come after you. I will chastise you. I will fight you to correct yourself. That is how freedom fighting is done. I will not take your matter to anybody to come and beg you because if you are in the same line with me, if you are in the same in the same forum with me, if we are together as media warriors in a in a in a cycle where issues are discussed, you will know that there are things you should do and things you shouldn't do. There should be done the, 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 the do and don't in terms of broadcasting because you cannot claim to be working for Mazen and can you go out and make a pronunciation that is going to affect the struggle, knowing fully well that people will tag it to IPOB say go and listen to one of them. That is their leader that asked them to say that. And we cannot continue to live in that way. We will not take 10 miles, the five steps ahead and 10 behind. No, we keep moving. And believe you me, be a fresh come in our own life. I am Mazen Balizichu became 
maje ale zijubi kama gobia fan kemba nambo eze wifi na wanini umale zoka kazo dia you may not like me but you must finally like everything that i've told you which is your fault go out there and fix it and take correction because biafra is our last hope and maje nambi kano will be free but it's different you could for you could be blessed for me and i greet all the members of the sense of christian to work command and the m branch each and every one of you that have contributed to this struggle financially may we keep continue to bless you and may we see onya fotata aga afuku yechi kemesiano but before i go wada uchechi okukano lolo you could be bless you for me and bless your children this is where i want to bring it to the end and as it hurts now so i don't talk thank you very very much Bye for now.